Hey guys, I'm Mari Ray and welcome back to more Animal Crossing New Horizons. So I'm actually on my lunch break at work right now. I always log in to do daily stuff while I'm on lunch because why not? And look who's here, guys. Look. Ah, oh, it's Flick. I've been waiting for this beautiful man, him or CJ, to come to my island because I have been hoarding bugs. I've been hoarding them, you guys, like lots and lots and lots and lots and lots of bugs because I've been waiting for him or CJ to come to my house. I wish it was CJ because I have a lot of fish that are taking up a lot of space, but I also have some bugs that I most certainly want to sell to him. He gives us bugs for a markup price and I'm really excited, so I'm going to go grab all that stuff and do it. I have to finish doing my dailies uh, which is what I was working on flick you stay right where you're at you beautiful lizard man I will be right back for you I swear it okay uh, I just need to finish doing my daily stuff and I'm gonna go grab all my stuff and I definitely wanted to record selling it because I want to see if it's worth me hoarding all of the bugs like I've been doing just so that I could give it to flick because I've been holding on to them now for a very very long time and I don't know if it's worth it, honestly, to be holding on to them or not. Like, how much money am I going to get from holding on to those things? I don't know. I don't know. I'm hoping that it's a substantial amount because it'd be really, really cool if we could walk away for a lot because I forgot to buy turnips this week. So I don't have any turnips at all. So I'm kind of hoping, really hoping that we can manage to get some good stuff from the bugs. So let me just finish doing all my daily stuff and then I'm going to go start grabbing the bugs and then we'll start selling and we'll see how much we walk out of this. Like, I'm gonna go clear my money. I want to see the exact amount that we walk away from from this. So let me just get everything set. I'm gonna try to do this fast because I gotta go back to work and... Uh, well, I got like 20 minutes, so I'll have to see. But let me let me just try to do all this stuff fast. I'll be right back, guys. Alrighty, guys, so I think I finished up all my dailies here. I got a few more minutes before I have to go back to work, but uh, I only have my tools, immediate tools. Actually, I could probably drop a couple of these. Can I just, can we just sit it down? Oh, or we can do that. I don't really care. But uh, I can probably get a couple more of these out of my inventory. I guess that, that's fine. I'll hold on to the ladder and to the other thing. I could probably drop the fishing pole. Uh, I'll hold on to the slingshot in case we see something. All right, cool. So I've cleared out my inventory and I'm going to try to fill it with as many of these bugs as I can get. I have zero bells on me because I want to see how worth it is. And I also caught this, this paper kite butterfly because I kind of figured let's just catch every single bug we can find. I know I have a couple heavy hitters here in the like scorpions. I never actually caught a tarantula. They kept knocking me unconscious and then they went out of season. So sad day i never caught a tarantula but um i have these butterflies here every everything everything we're going to grab it all and we're going to sell it to flick and i'm going to see if i go from zero to a significant uh a number of bells and if it's actually worth hoarding all these bugs uh for flick to come i mean i probably will stop once i have a substantial amount of bells but like i i was so broke that i was kind of hoping that he would come by and that i would be able to just provide him with a ton of bugs and, you know, make a profit. This is not all the bugs that I have saved either, guys. There's more. There's more to this. And when CJ comes, I'm a oops. I'm going to do the same thing. I have all the plans in the world to do the exact same thing. Uh, I've moved them in here because I have so many bugs. And like I just said, I don't know if it's worth doing. Uh, I'm pretty sure these are not all the most expensive bugs. But, hey. Hey, we're doing this, all right? How much more can I fit in my inventory? I can fit a couple more. So let's go to the back room. All right, let's keep collecting all of our bugs here. We've got half a room of bugs back here. I think that might be it. Two more, two more. No, not the fish, darn it. Okay, wait, let me put the fish back. Can you please put him back? Thank you. All right, so now our pockets are full. So let's go talk to Flick and sell him what we have. Then we'll come back and get the rest of it and sell him all of that. I'm hoping we can walk away with at least over 100,000 bells would be nice. Like... I mean, I've been hoarding these things, taking up space in my house for I don't know how long. So walking away with at least 100,000 bills would be nice. All right, Flicky boy, I'm ready to talk to you. Oh, uh, hi. Do you live here? I'm Flick. I'm kind of a bug buff, an insect enthusiast, an anthropod artisan. I love all bugs and their appendages. I've been traveling across all the islands looking for my soul bug, the perfect inspiration for my art. 
I must capture every wiggly leg, each joint of the antenna. We're so lucky that we live in our world. So, if you find a bug, will you sell it to me? I can pay a little extra, no price. It's too high for my... I can't read that. Kindred, okay. <laughs> and, and that's any bug. Devotion with condition. Devoid of condition. That's devotion. Devotion. I'm, I can't read you guys. Uh, oh, and if you're um, interested in my art at all, just let me know. My commissions are open. I've got bugs to sell. Really? What kind? Well, <laughs> let me see where I can start. All of these, sir. How much will you give me for all of these? A whole swarm. This is the best day ever. Oh, tone it down, Flick. <clears throat> I can oh my god, 185,000 bells? Yes? Please? Really? Th thank you. My man, Flick, I love you. You're welcome back here anytime you want. Let me know if you can catch any more. Uh, <laughs> I'll be right back. I will be right back. Alright, so we have the last wave of butterflies. I went and got them. I'm assuming this is going to be a smaller haul. One, I don't have a full inventory. And two, wait. Every bug. Oh my god. There we go. Every bug. But um, I'm assuming it's going to be a lot less. I don't have scorpions in this batch either, which I know are worth, like, way more. Uh, so, Flicky Boy. I'm truly listening to the needs of the ladybugs whenever I ear poses. Oh, uh, hi. Have you caught any bugs yet? I'm happy to buy any kind of bug that you catch. And if you want to commission some of my art, just let me know. Uh, I know he can make me like sculptures or something, but I'm more interested in money right now. Like I will do a sculpture later. I feel like I will, I mean, I don't know how often he comes back, but I'm assuming as long as I have the bugs like on me, I can get a sculpture made. So let's just sell all of these. What you give me? A whole swarm is the best day ever. 105,990. Yes. Yes, you can. Please take them. Take them off my hands. Gladly. We made 200,000 bells. 291,000 bells. And I will definitely be giving him even more. I'm happy about that. We gave. We freaking got uh, 291,000 bells. I will take it. I will certainly take it. All right, I'm gonna go put this in the bank. I feel rich now. Oh my god, you guys. Uh, any bugs we see, or uh, any bug. Oops, why? Why am I such a doofus? Come on. Oh my god. So guys, I've been wandering around catching some bugs just to see what I can get from just catching a bunch of bugs from Flick and Adi has the thought bubble. So I don't know if she wants to move or if she just wants me to do something for her. So let's chat with her and see. I've got a surprise for you. Nope, she just wants to give me something. What is it, Adi? Boom, Prezi. Aw, what'd you give me? A track jacket. It's from my bestie. Oh my god, super fab, right? I love, uh, I hope that you'd like it. Okay, well, thank you, Adi. Um, check it out. We got a track jacket from Adi. Thanks, Adi. That's super nice of you. She's such a sweetheart. I've, I've said it before, I don't plan for Adi to necessarily stay here in this town, and that's mostly just because she was an early villager, meaning that her house will never be, like, personalized to match her personality. So I do have plans to move Adi out, so I'll definitely be probably thinking of giving her away. So if anybody's interested and you watch this video, then just let me know. Um, we can chat, because I do plan to move Adi out eventually. Flick, how much will you give me for just random common things? If a yellow butterfly were to manifest before me, how would I react? Laughter? Weeping? Hmm. <laughs> Flick is so weird. Uh, I, I want to see what he's going to give me, though, just for a bunch of random bugs that I just caught, like, out of nowhere. Like, how much money will this get me? Is it worth me continuing to catch a bunch of random bugs? Flicky boy, how much? 6,000 bells. So, obviously not near as lucrative as my other mini, 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 mini valuable bugs that we got, but... It might be worth catching some more, but for now, I have to go back to work. So I'll log back on a little bit later and we can see if we can get any more money from them.
So guys, it's the next day and look who's here. Like I seriously, honestly do not know. Is it normal for like Flick to come to your island one day and then this dude to come the next day? Because that's exactly what happened and I am actually kind of happy about that because I have so much fish. I actually locked him inside of a fish box a little while ago. Um, like seriously, oh my God, Dobby, you're in a good mood. You're just like waving to everybody. Look at you, Dobster. He's so happy. The Dobster's good. I've also started moving some of the villager houses. I've moved Raymond's house over here. Have to decorate around the outside, you know? Could only move one at a time once a day. But this fish dude's here, which makes me super happy. I've loaded up my inventory with some of the fish. Now, I had done this earlier today because I always play on my lunch break at work and I was playing today on my lunch break at work and the CJ was standing over here. So I had built him a nice, wonderful box made of fish just for him. And he, uh, he escaped. So, not happy about that. Probably because I had to turn off the game, uh, for a while. But, uh, yeah, C CJ escaped. He escaped his confinements, and, um, how dare he is all I have to say about that situation. Um, he was not supposed to escape his confinement whatsoever. Uh, I'm just grabbing all of the fish that I have, and I'm gonna go clear out my money because I most certainly... Want to see how much money we get from this just by selling all the fish that I've caught. Now I've... Oh, oh my god, is Dobby singing? <laughs> Guys, Dobby's singing. This is so adorable. <laughs> it's so cute! Oh my god, and Pika's singing with him! Oh my god, you guys! This is making me so happy! I so wish we could sing with them! This is so cute! Yay! Bravo! Beautiful job, Pika and Dobby. That was so adorable, you guys! Okay, yes, I put that radio there because the villagers will sometimes stop to sing when there's a radio down, and I had put it there a while back. And that's the first time I ever saw Dobby and Pika singing! Normally, it's- I see, um... I'll see, um... Fauna singing a lot. And I'll see, um... Sometimes I think I've seen Audrey Audie? Not Audrey. Audie singing a little bit. But I had never seen Dobby and, and Pika sing. That was so cute. I love watching my villagers sing. It's so adorable. All right, three, three, five. I'm putting all of my money in the bank. That's right. We actually have enough to pay our loan, but I don't know if I want to be more in debt to the raccoon just yet. Let me see how much money I make. Maybe that'll persuade me because I didn't get to buy turnips this week. So maybe if I can make a killing off of this fish and bug since freaking... I made like 291,000 bells from Flick yesterday. So maybe I can make a bunch of money off of this guy. So he always gives you, or I don't know if he always does, but he gave me a challenge to do. So I basically uh, did a challenge. Aren't there collectibles? But I did a challenge for him, which was to just catch five fish in a row. And I did that. Um, so let me just tell him to buy some fish. What do you want to sell? I'm gonna give him right now just the common fish real quick, get those out of the way, because I kind of want to see how much all those ore fish will sell for. Yes, those are all of the ore fish that I had in my storage, and I want to do those separately. So that's only like 4,000, which is fine. They're all super common fish. Thank you, CJ. I'll be right back, but I do still want to see. Makes you happy, blah, blah, blah. Hold on, let me go back and pick up some more of my fish real quick. Full inventory, guys. Full inventory. I I wanted to try to see, though, how much we get from just selling the orfish. Uh, those are giant trevally, I think. I think these are common fish back here that I... That I put up, I think. Let me see what I have. Okay, yes. These are the last bit of the weird common fish that I caught today. Um, and then we can sell all of our big heavy hitters. And I want to see so badly how much money we make. Okay, so 7,200 is what we have right now from just selling common fish. So I'm going to sell every last ore fish that I've caught, and I caught a lot. And I'm just going to sell the ore fish because I think those are the most expensive fish that I have. And I want to know how much how much money I'm going to get for that. Um, I know you can get collectibles, but I'm not really too interested in honestly collecting the collectibles. I feel like they're just going to get in my way. Um, I don't know if you get anything for having collectibles, but... This, I need money. 
So, all my ore fish only. How much will you give me? Oh, 162,000 bells for the ore fish alone. Yes. Yes, please. Take them. Take them and give me money. I will sell you everything that I have, CJ. You are awesome, my mans. Okay, so... That gives us this. Now these turtles, I'm gonna sell to him as well. They're like 4,000 a piece, I think. I'm not even sure. But let's go fill up our inventory with more fish and then sell him everything we've got. Okay, that's all the fish that I had stored up, guys. So we made, what was it, a hundred and, no, four hundred and ninety-eight thousand seven hundred. I can't even remember, but we almost made five hundred thousand bells by selling fish. And he's gonna be here all day, which means I'm just gonna go fishing for the rest of the day and uh, stockpile fish and continue to sell it to him because why not? Eight eight. Seven zero zero. Look at that! Four hundred and eighty-eight thousand. I actually have over a million bells in the bank. That's like the first time I think that that ever happened. Oh my gosh! I feel really good. Now I could potentially blow all of that to Mr. Nook over here, over there dusting and stuff. Yeah, you better clean this office. But I think what I'm gonna go do right now is continue to fish because, uh, yeah, while he's here, I'm going to uh, abuse that. So. Time to go do some fishing. 